I'm noticing people beginning to self-organize in two different camps. People who seem to be able to respond with a kind of integrated personality that generates creativity, creative acts, creative responses, and another camp that is feeling deeply hopeless and is trying to substitute the old life with some other kind of an ordering process to eliminate uncertainty, trying to excessively prescribe how to think and how to act. So this idea of moving forward into this creative relationship to the self or regressing backwards into whatever kind of a structured, determined system that can restore a sense of safety. Now, those two things may be in each person to some degree, but I'm noticing camps begin to settle out in those two categories, which is worth tracking, I think. So it's interesting. Uh, you're, you know, the meaning I'm making of what you're saying is uh, the theme of how we make meaning that we need narratives, we need storylines. And if perhaps we can stay in the don't know and the uncertainty, uh, we may find some creative wellsprings within ourselves or our immediate surrounds and uh, be able to respond uh, proactively in some way, uh, internally and perhaps externally. If we don't have that, uh, we may revert to internal and external sort of authoritarian structures and narratives uh, that that this is, and there are those out there. Uh, there are conspiracy theories and all kinds of things in order to have some kind of meaning-making structure uh, that's often external rather than internal. Yeah, and, you know, that, that goes to Jung's uh, religious function of the psyche, right? That our psyche is built to need meaning mm -hmm. and that the need for meaning and the drive to find meaning is a fundamental ordering principle of the human psyche. And where traditional meanings have been swept away, where the things that kind of kept us tethered to an orderly life are suddenly taken off the table, we will try to fill that vacuum. And one place that we might reach will be a kind of authoritarianism, whether it's kind of self-imposed or we reach to find it out in the collective. And it can be an inner authoritative figure. Absolutely. Yes, we regress back to some kind of... Uh, a belief in a set of rules which has never really been adequately questioned or somehow comes from a very early part of our lives that can over time be rather suffocating, although in the short term it feels relieving. Mm 